Hi, Mark Savage here. Welcome to Light Bites and welcome to my channel. Over 400 videos on everything you need to watch. Type in Mark Savage and then what you're after and hopefully it'll be on my channel. Today's chat, carburetor. Now, I've done loads of videos on carburetors and I do mean loads, but I don't often mix them. 2T carburetor, 4T carburetor. What a difference. And yet both of these are from 50ccs. <laughs> Big difference. They are very different carburetors, but basically still the same. Auto choke, petrol in, oil in these, and on this one, the air intake goes on the manifold. Auto choke, petrol in, but clearly they have this big dome bit, which is the vacuum. On the two T's, the vacuum is the petrol tank is. These are the vacuum on top. But generally, I say every time your bike's not running right, it's really, really simple, just clean the carburetor. Now sometimes on these 40s, it's hard to get to and you can't really get them out well. And they're wired in with lots of little bits and bobs. So you can literally undo what you can, turn it upside down, undo the four screws, take it off, clean your jets, spray it all up. I mean, I do advise really get the damn thing out. You can clean it up properly. You don't really need to touch in here and sometimes you break the uh, anywhere the seal, you're gonna break the little vacuum bit, so leave that alone. If it's not working, you need to get another one anyway rather than try and mess around. Parts are hard to get. Still basically the same, slides in there. You can still get your carb cleaner in there. When it's upside down, take that off and you can spray all in there with your carb cleaner, get your jets out. Don't use anything else but carb cleaner. People have said to me before, can you use WD-40? That's a no, it's an oil-based water repellent for god's sake so don't use that and don't just dip it in petrol because it's sitting in petrol it's not going to do much is it so use carb cleaner 2t do come off easier and generally easy to get hold of and again just take that off clean it all up the floats be careful my best tip would be when you've got this off take pictures so when it all goes back in you don't muck up because sometimes you can't find well or you're missing the pin make sure when you do it's clean and tidy and not on decking because you lose the pins you're screwed so don't do that. There you go, short little one on a 50cc and a 50cc carbs for two T's and four T's. This is a performance carb. Again, I've done a video on this performance carb, massive. And this goes on a 50cc. Now that is a different entrance. I think this is 21, 23, I'm not 100% sure, rather than the 17.5 you normally have. Big difference. A lot more speed, a lot more tuning though. You normally use this when you've done a big bore kit, which I hate. So that's the difference in carburetors and how to clean. Thanks for watching. You take care of yourselves on the road. Please like, share, and subscribe. I'll keep making them while you keep watching them. <laughs> Too cheesy? <laughs> Ta-da!